Good morning, children. Welcome to Year 3 English. Objectives of the lesson. Define superlative adjective. Write superlative adjectives. And number 3, practice comparing three or more things using superlative adjectives. Now, let's learn about superlatives. But what is adjectives? Adjective, a word that describes a noun. A noun is a person, place, or thing. Adjectives tell details about nouns like a friendly woman, a tall building, and a furry bear. Friendly, tall, and furry are all adjectives. Can you use adjectives to describe these cats? Adjectives can describe how something looks. So you might have said it's orange or cute. Adjectives can also describe how something feels. You said soft. They can also tell how something acts, like happy or nice. Adjectives can even tell how many, so two is an adjective also. Superlative adjectives. So let's define superlative adjectives. Compares three or more nouns and shows the noun with the highest degree. Superlative adjectives are used to distinguish objects or nouns if there are three or more things which are being compared. There is rule. We often add EFT to an adjective to make it into superlative. Note, we are going to compare three or more things or nouns. For example, My house is the largest one on our street. This is the smallest car I've ever seen. So I have here example of adjective. Clever, tall, small, short, old, long, fast, and slow. Now, let's change it to superlative adjectives plus EST, cleverest. Tallest, smallest, shortest, oldest, longest, fastest, and slowest. Let's use it in a sentence. I have here three boys. Let's name them as A, B, and C. Let's use the adjective tall. How many boys we are comparing here? It's three. C is the tallest than A and B. Let's name them as Anna, Nina, and Karen. Let's use the adjective short. Who is the shortest among the three? So, Anna is the shortest than Nina and Karen. This is cat, mouse, and ant. Let's use the adjective small. Who is the smallest? Ant is the smallest than cat and mouse. So, this is Bella. We use the adjective clever. Bella is the cleverest girl in the class. So, we compare Bella to the whole class. Now, open your language book, page 151. Underline the superlative adjective in each sentence. That's the first instruction. And number one, tallest is the superlative adjective. And number two, oldest. Number three, sweetest. 
Number four, shortest. Number five, longest. And number six, smallest. Now write the adjective and the superlative adjective. And number one is already given. Tall and tallest. Number two, what is the adjective? It's old. And the superlative? Oldest. Number three, sweet. Sweetest. Number four, it's short. Shortest. Number five, long. Longest. And number six, small. Smallest. Open your practice book, page 121. Clever, cleverest. What is the superlative of tall? It's tallest. How about what is the adjective of oldest? It's old. How about for short? It's shortest. What is the adjective of longest? It's long. And the adjective for smallest? It's small. What is the superlative of slow? It's slowest. Now, let's complete each sentence with the superlative of the adjective. Number one, Mount Everest is the tallest mountain in the world. Number two, the adjective is clever. Tom is the cleverest boy in the class. Number three, slow. A tortoise is the slowest animal I know. Number four, the red sports car was the fastest car in the race. Number five, I came last in the race and took the longest time. Number six, I am the smallest in our family. Number seven, Mr. Brown has got the longest nose I've ever seen. Number eight, my grandfather is the oldest relative I've got. Thank you for watching.